I'm Sonia Burke at the grounds of City Hall for the 8th Annual Gaithersburg Book Festival. This year's book festival was bigger than ever. There was a record number of authors and thousands of book lovers who traveled from near and far to spend their Saturday reading books and meeting some of their favorite authors. Everywhere I look, there's a lot of people, and so and they seem to be having a good time. That makes me happy. This literary event showcases Gaithersburg's diversity, and that theme was evident everywhere you turned. There was music, a children's village, writing workshops, food, and of course, lots of books. Everybody comes to this like a celebration, not a club, but a celebration of ideas, books, biography, history. I love it. A big crowd showed up early to hear author Mark Shriver talk about his new book about Pope Francis. I'm learning from him every day because he's a great teacher and I hope the book <laughs> spreads that message of humility and mercy and faith. In another tent, Montgomery County Council member George Leventhal was in conversation with author Dan Zack, who has written a book about the ongoing threat of nuclear weapons. This book is about how and why this break-in happened. It was standing room only for author J. Courtney Sullivan, whose latest novel was recently described as a quiet masterpiece by the Washington Post Ron Charles. I'm currently eight and a half months pregnant and I'm having a boy, so I thought, well, we have to name our child Ron Charles now. That's the only uh, response to a review like that. Um, no, it was wonderful. It was a thrilling thing to read that review. Who were you here today to see? Uh, specifically, Miss Sullivan and also Meg Medina, who's a YA author. We come almost every year. I, I think it's gotten a lot bigger. It's very popular. Parking is atrocious, but <laughs> it's wonderful. It's incredible that this many people come out. There were about 130 authors at this event, including Sidney Blumenthal, Herman Parrish, Nathan Hill, Laura Lippman. The list just goes on and on. It is amazing. Gaithersburg. Uh, having a big festival like this is fantastic. And so you think, wow, the person who wrote Good Night, Good Night Construction Site, or the person who wrote I Wish You More, you know, you get a chance to really actually meet them, your kids get a chance to meet them, and it's just really a fun time, and it, it, it emphasizes the importance of books and reading to the younger generation. The way they've coordinated and organized, it's, it's just fantastic. I'm bringing my family here next year. If you miss this event, save the date. The ninth annual Gaithersburg Book Festival is scheduled for May 19th, 2018. In Gaithersburg, I'm Sonia Burke for MyMC Media.